A tip on social media helps prevent a possible shooting at an elementary school in Northeast Austin. The tipster alerted the FBI to 17-year-old Gianna Castillo and her posts about planning a shooting at her former elementary school. CBS Austin's Adelia Cheetah joins us live tonight after spending the day digging through her arrest warrant and social media posts. Adela, what did you find? Wald, uh, what was written there was pretty disturbing. Gianna Castillo allegedly wrote about hating people and trying to acquire a gun. But one expert says the fact that this was averted may encourage other people to report when they see disturbing things online. This is 17-year-old Gianna Castillo. She is now facing one charge of terroristic threat for allegedly planning a shooting at Graham Elementary School in the Austin Independent School District. But a tip helped law enforcement avert tragedy and arrest her last week. One thing makes this case different from so many others. It's very rare to have a female teenager shooter. Uh, there, there's been so few of them that I don't think there's any really strong research on them because there are so few. Almost all of them in the United States and Europe have been males. Uh, young males. In many ways, though, this case has a lot of similarities to other mass shootings. Ron Avi Aster is a professor of social welfare at UCLA focusing on school violence. The other piece that's really common with her is that she's putting it all over the internet. Uh, most of the other shooters have done that. And that's why when you said that you're reporting on an averted shooting, I was uh, really commending you for doing that. In some of those social media posts, Castillo expresses self-loathing, hatred, and talks about trying to acquire a gun and ammunition. Someone saw the post written by hammer.mishap or hammer underscore mishap on Instagram and tipped off the Federal Bureau of Investigation. Agents traced the accounts back to Castillo, who interviewed her last week, leading to her arrest and charge of terroristic threat. I I think thinking about these kinds of shootings as terrorism is actually really helpful. Professor Astor says this time reporting on an averted shooting may encourage more people to report concerning social media posts in the future. The number one uh, reason why these shootings are averted is because a friend or a family member or somebody who's reading the post or some kind of email that they got realizes that this is serious enough that they need to let somebody know about it. Austin ISD, in the meantime, is increasing its police presence here at Graham Elementary School for the time being. Reporting live in Northeast Austin, Adele Uchida, CBS Austin News.